Okay guys, so we just experienced the first CTD in this stupid fucking game that I start to hate. Um, last time we were attacking here and we have lost incredible armies, so we're just gonna forget about it. We're not gonna attack anymore here. We're just gonna get our asses back. And we're gonna try to attack right there. Oh, let's see if everything has been saved. Actually, yeah, it has been saved, because last time we had captured Sparta, and now we're besieging Corinthos. So yeah, last, next time we're just gonna try to attack Segundum and try to take it out, although we still have a lot of troops here. Um, and we're gonna leave this down right now, because there is no way that we're gonna lose our troops in the combo. That will be the first thing. Second of all, let's see, we should send more armies in Rome. First of all, let's get rid of these rebels. Right, so, and third of all, we should simply... This will try to increase the public rate, public order here. in uh, goals in the public order is okay. That's good. We have two armies standing by here. I'm not gonna use it just yet. Alright, so let's recruit more troops. Let's build up and let's go on with the game. Unfortunately, we seem to be extremely Expensive. But I'm still gonna try to put up bigger army. So we have no price reduction here except right here, but just a little bit. And actually, I think in Rome we have a huge price reduction. But so price reduction, which means that we could build something else such as hospital maybe, that's gonna be extremely expensive, but let's actually try it. Here is also a little bit better, but I don't think that we have necessary denari right now to build up. There's also no difference. Population growth bonus. And... There's no need for this. This is going to be too expensive. Okay, good. Now, let's go on with the game. See what's going to happen next turn. Oh, yes. Let's see what we have here. So, they are attacking, I think, with an other army. We still have an advantage against them. They have just a few units of levy hoplites, a general, and then the army beside the town. So, with a little bit of luck, I think we could defeat them. Let's see what's gonna come out of it. I carry a oh yes, so this is their army, just a few levy phalanx that gonna be destroyed. Good. No. So this is what they have here. Hellenic skirmishers, a general, 21, a very young one, and some Hellenic level phalanxes. This is not going to be a problem. I think that we kind of 
gonna completely finish them off here. And if you're gonna chase them, and this is gonna happen because they are attacking us, they might have no troops left in the town, so we could be able to take the town. Let's see, none of this levy felons have fallen until now. We're attacking them as quickly as, as we can. Right, zero percent killed. This is so fucked up, and I have so many archers, including these Kraken archers. Finally, some of them have fallen. Let's attack them. Oh yes, I think that general has fallen. That's right. Atrilatos Filipeos. And... Oh, this is their general again, attacking my Hastadi. And Arconte Stai are also trying to attack my troops, and here comes the other army. Now we should go and chase these guys before they're gonna come back. No, this is not a good idea. Let's get back. Actually, let's give it a strike right here. This was the poorest charge I ever fucking seen. Now we have lost another two units. They are retreating. Most important thing that we're not gonna. Okay, let them attack then. So now we can chase them again. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's hurry up. This is they gonna come back. Oh, they have completely annihilated some of our... What is this? Levy Hope Lights. Against them. Levy Hope Lights. Do we have any... Yeah, we have. I should actually have... Okay, time to send these guys back, quickly. I, th I think this is everything what they have. Wait a minute, they still, they still have... So many classical hoplites and shit like that. I'm also having a lot of skirmishes that are actually not doing anything. How the fuck this idiot came here? Oh yeah, whatever. Wait, let's wait. Oh yes, they are retreating, that's good. Let's take them here. It's right here with the general. This is gonna be a victory, but a very difficult one. Them as well. So we'll just chase these guys there. We still have some levy felons fighting. And the one of the generals is dead finally. And we're gonna have to chase them completely. With everything we have. What is it? Did they come back? No. Oh yes, now this is their last troop remaining, but like I said, we're gonna chase them not to the last man, because we can definitely need to, um... So do they have any men left here? Mm. Oh yes, there yeah, they are. So let's call for them. Let's see, to the last man, like I said. Oh yes, they are fleeing, that's good. 
and there might, might be some other troops right here, but we're just gonna wait a little bit. I think we have chased them enough. I think they just have like... So they are still fighting. Chasing them. Us will us here. Have an experiment. So they might, they they should have no troops inside. Now let's see who they have. Left. Oh, there you go. There it is. A unit of accountant style skirmishers. And another one right there. So when they're gonna flee, then they're gonna be completely destroyed. Let's see. Let, let, let's let them arrive because. That's right, our archers will take care of them. <laughs> they're already fleeing. Okay. So there are 69 troops left and inside the town, zero. Because we should easily take the town, although they gotta counterattack us. But I don't think they, get, they have any big force over there. Victory! They might have taken with that general in Calchas. No, they didn't. Rome they didn't. Conquered. That means that Corinthos belongs to us now. That is extraordinary. I could quickly put up an army and attack Athens. And this is what I'm gonna actually do right now. Another question is, how am I gonna take Secundo? But first of all, let's do this. First of all, let's get rid of these guys, yeah? Second of all, let's destroy some buildings because we cannot recruit anyway. No one. What do we have here in Corinthos? With incredible goods. A lot of towns, a lot of buildings have been damaged here. I think I'm gonna have to repair a lot. There is a fortress. Four thousand, give me a fucking break. One thousand. Eleven thousand, Statue of Zeus. I really didn't expect this. Oh, you motherfucker. Everything I've conquered here is gone. And now I would have, theoretically, a very good opportunity to take this down here. So you know what? Let's just take the risk and take it out. Well, first of all, I want to ride there. Second of all, I just want to give him the best of troops available. Then attack Athens. It's just a matter of time until we're gonna take it. We should take it right away. Now, this is such a fucking big bullshit with these towns that. with these buildings that have been destroyed in Corinthus. Corinthus is, of course, an incredible, extremely important town. Anyway, let's take them here. So they're gonna have theoretically no chance at all. Then, now they're gonna can't attack. Oh, they are out of move because it's winter, you piece of shit, you red motherfucker. Everything is going wrong. Everything is going completely fucking wrong. Here, everything. At this fucking view. Alright. Just have just a little bit more money now, but 
we lost the chance of taking Atlas because these fucking idiots are not moving any far, any faster, any, f any farther. Stupid motherfucker. Okay, so what can we do with these guys? Well, nothing because they cannot even fucking move. So let's just bring them right here. Right, and we're just gonna. I don't know. I, I really don't know. I'm just gonna try to take Zikundo. If it's not gonna work, then I'm gonna go farther south and take Pella or something like that. We still have a huge advantage. Let's see. First of all, let's take, get rid of these rebels here. Finally, I've accepted to fight a battle. Victory! Prepare for battle. But there is a, an enormous rebel army here that we're gonna have to take and fight by ourselves. Anyway, let's see. Let's put up some new forces here. New troops. Orders. Let's recruit new troops. Four thousand denali left. We we'll also build up some new things if we can. Okay, so that we can, for example, here. Speed it up, and then let's go on with the game. There is another attack. Exactly what I thought. Whatever. So what do we have here? They do have a nice army here, but it's not big enough. Let's see. Oh my god, give me a fucking break. Who the fuck is this Greek bodyguard? Much stronger than the German, than the Roman bodyguard. Let's see, Helen Kalit Phalanx. This is gonna be almost impossible to defeat. This guy's also a royal guard. Medium Phalanx. They do have Phalanx, but this does seem to be the best opponent they have. This Medium Cavalry. I think they're gonna defeat us, they just have a bad feeling about this battle, but like I said, I wanted to take the risk, and now let's try it. They can of course retreat in Athens, and they get a counterattack, so... Or perhaps they're gonna be able to besiege another town, let's see, we're just gonna see how it's gonna develop. If we can win this battle. Now, let's check. Let's start a battle, no time for bullshit, so let's see. Yeah, that's okay. Okay, that's okay. Now let's see. Where is their big cavalry? Right there. And their journey is also having 38 men. Very few phalanxes, actually, only a few units of phalanxes. This shouldn't be that difficult, I guess. It would have been, of course, much helpful if we're gonna have some. Or when were they trying to attack from behind? Now, this is gonna be difficult. Hopefully, they're not gonna take our general. 42, they have already lost some men. Let's stay and fight a battle. Oh, they have attacked with their general. They have already lost some men. That's really good. It's not going very good for them. This is this Rari right there. Come on, you idiots. I just just wait with this guys a little bit. So their cavalry is dead. Important now is that their general will die. Okay, time to move on. Yeah, they have a right here. All 
All right, your cavalry is done. This can still fire. Okay, took it the wrong way. Now, theoretically, I could have taken from behind, but I'm just gonna have to wait a little bit. I have a huge advantage at this point. Although, unfortunately, their general is still alive, but I think he's gonna die sh soon. You must die soon. You know what? Let's go and get him. We have. So they have three left. Gonna have to keep our general alive still. Two, and we have four. Yeah, let's bring down this general. Wait a minute, not like that. Oh, fall then we're gonna have a huge advantage. Come on, what the fuck is taking so long? Look at him, he's encircling, he's still fighting. Alright, they are all retreating. Fucking bullshit. Look at this. This guy is still fighting. But this is a bug or what? After 100 years. Motherfucker. Ah, these guys will also be very soon completely destroyed. Gonna have no chance at all. So that was a nice battle, I have to say. I was just about to lose it, but actually it worked well. So let's just say their army has been completely destroyed and we have lost also a lot of men. It was a very difficult battle. Now their troops gonna retreat to Athens. It would have been a very important thing, very lucky thing could have taken Athens, but I don't think this is gonna happen very soon. What? Jing here with a very small army. Yeah, let's fight it anyway. Oh, this is the other army. It's a mistake. I think they're gonna retreat. Yeah, they should get in here. So come on, I'm gonna wait for you guys. Come on, you, you, you have a tag me, so... There is another passage there, I think. Yeah, it is. You know what, let's go there. 
Perhaps we could pass in there and we could attack them and destroy them. Okay, no, they're not doing anything. Yeah, great, then let's pass it. Let's go right here. Ah, I guess it's gonna be alright. Let's go. I see they still don't want to attack. My mantra is gonna be tired, but doesn't matter. So let's go closer. Let's wait. No time to send out general flight. We have some really cavalry. Whatever. This is bullshit. We're gonna completely destroy them. Some really cavalry. They're gonna die right away. Really cost a levis. Just getting sure what it. They have archers or something. Come on, you shouldn't run. Let's go after them. Our stingers will take care of the rest. What are this? Coastal Levis. Experience for these guys. Yeah. An experiment. And this is their general, which perhaps will flee or maybe will not flee. Classical Oh, this, are, this is a very heavy infantry and. I'm gonna have to take care of a bit of their cavalry, it's going to be very big. Let's get them from behind with our general, I'm gonna risk a little bit. Yeah, he's trying to take our general, it's not gonna happen. Thirty-nine. Oh yes, you have lost a lot of men. Still having thirty, twenty-eight. Three classical hoplites. Oh, this is not gonna work. Let's flee. And let's hunt them down. There will be no escape for them. 13 remained.
though the great general is still fighting. Not sure what the AP Euros are doing. Finally a general. It's gonna stay there. This guy's gonna also stay there in Chernobyl. Okay, right. Can we attack Athens? Of course not. Or maybe, maybe... Actually, we will. We will attack it. Oh shit, you motherfucker. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to send some more troops here. Oh, I'm not sure we can deal with these guys. We'll need... Five thousand fucking bullshit. That would be enough. Now let's attack this idiots and let's see if we can take them out in order to increase this the, the pressure here on Athens. Oh, they should be extremely easy. What do they have here? Skirmisher cavalry. And... Yeah, they have skirmishers. Yeah, let's fight a battle. Yeah, this is a very poor army, but let's just attack it because I want to reinforce that army that is besieging Athens. With a little bit, a little bit of luck, we're gonna take Athens, and this would be an extraordinary... extraordinary advantage. We're gonna make it. So, let's see. With a gun. Yeah, let's go. They have a very good infantry here, but they have skirmishers, and these are very good skirmishers, so we're gonna have to be very careful about what's gonna happen next. Arriving. Or actually not. They cannot fire, but we can fire, so 
Let's keep our advantage. They have only then skirmishers, whatever. Oh, they're already attacking them. We're gonna lose a lot of men. Hopefully, should we? I should have retreated our general. It's too idiotic to see what the fuck is going on. We have already lost some men. Oh, they have native spearmen. They are attacking us with their native spearmen. I think they are fleeing. That's exactly what I wanted. was actually easy. I think that if we can take Greece, we can have almost... If we can take Athens, then we can have almost the whole of Greece. That would have been... Or that would be an extraordinary achievement. Let's see. Victory! Unfortunately, they have retreated here, but we can still attack them. No, we can't. No, they will definitely attack us right here. There will be a lot of forces involved. And this is something that I don't like. Not only they have another family member here inside. Imperator, sir. Theoretically, Imperator, send another troop here. Orders. Because sir. what I wanted is to Orders. make more space for... Like I said, I'm gonna take like all or nothing. Oh, this is very risky what I'm trying to do here, but I have to take the whole risk because if you're gonna take Athens, we're gonna be it's gonna be extraordinary. We're already having some two very nice armies that are besieging it. If we're gonna lose it, they could counterattack us and completely annihilate us. Second of all, let's see what is going on in the north now. We're almost out of the money, we don't have any more money. The main thing is to attack them Segundum right here and try to take it out. So let's go with our armies there. Unfortunately, this is as far as these guys can move. Although, don't have too many troops here. So we, theoretically, we could easily attack them there. We're gonna attack them, no problem at all. Now, second of all, let's take care. General. This general is moving so... Look at him. Prepare for battle. So difficult. Now, let's build something new. Let's see where. Let's go, for example, here. Gonna definitely need a new building here. Or use a new building. Okay, there will be all. And now let's go on with the game. A huge battle would take place here in Athens, I know. An epic battle, and then we're gonna be CC Quinto. Hopefully we're gonna take it. But this time we're gonna take care of it later. I don't think they're gonna be able to recruit a lot of troops from that time. At least now. Let's focus on taking Greece because Greece is the most important region ever. As you can see here we're gonna already have a huge income. Here in Ambrakia, we're already having great. And uh, yeah, we're gonna. We just have three towns left to take, most of which are not very well defended, I have to say, except their capital. 
Pella I should also be taking very soon. Not to mention the Macedonians are also having a lot of towns in Asia Minor where we're also gonna try to expand up again territories. And then it's gonna be great. Signal War, let's see what's going on on the Western Front where the Lusitanians and the Carthaginians are undecided whether to attack us or attack us. Because they have a rebellion there, but they're not doing almost anything. Which will give us a great advantage. So, let's go on. Yeah, I guess I thought, so let's see, they're attacking, I'm not sure which are, well, we still have an advantage here, and I'm sure that we're gonna manage to destroy them. This is the most important they have inside. This army with whom they are attacking is only one elite Hellenic phalanx. It should be taken out easily. So, let's see. I still think we're gonna, we're gonna win the battle. With a little bit of luck, and if we're gonna chase them, then we can already take Athens. But let's see, first of all, let's win the battle. So, oh, they are attacking from behind somehow. Very strange, I thought that. And there are a lot of troops. I think this is their um, town army. They're inside the town army or something. Okay, now the thing is how we gonna defend because. This is the other army they are sending. Okay. First of all, I want to defend against this army because this one seems to be the, the most dangerous. So let's send our troops there. And um, we're gonna regroup quickly. They are attacking from behind, wait a minute. Yeah, they're just gonna ride there. I'm just gonna have to send this there. First of all, let's see what we have here. Okay, good. So we defend the captain. And there's an attack with our inside army, inside the town, and they have another poor troops right there, so it shouldn't be that difficult to take them out. That's right here with this Ferrari. We have another army there. I think we should be able to defeat that. Yeah, just as they thought. No, I don't need to put them in. This is elite phalanx. They're gonna fight to the end, but not if we're gonna insert them. Listen, this variety as well. Not sure. I think we're taking collateral damage here. They have lost one man. That's extraordinary. Astounding. They have a great general there inside Athens. This is everything I can do here. Still 100. Very difficult. And we're gonna soon give a charge with this general. But good. They have, oh my god, 47 cavalry men, and take a look at this cavalry, like 34 defense or something. The question is what our ally is doing, because we need them right now here. But we tried to do something, so what do they have? Classical hoplites. Yeah, yeah, also very, very strong. So, for your charge, they have lost no man. This guy's here, yeah, they are soon gonna fall. Thirty-nine. That would be so important if we could use some help from our allies, but unfortunately not. This general is still having thirty. Oh, 
Good time to turn to this. Now we're gonna have to let these guys there. So our troops are already retreating. We have a lot of infantry on the other side. The fuck are these guys doing right there? And that's actually all what we have now. Our allies should also provide some help. That would be so important. Someone has died, I think. Yeah. Elite Phalanx. So let's provide some support here. Important is to bring down the general. This is the secret. They have 18 men fighting. Who can send? What is our allies doing? They are stuck here with two of their troops. Man, they have so many fucking units. I just didn't thought they can have so many units. Where the fuck did they, all these units come from? Their general is still alive. Oh, wait a minute. This guy's in retreat, I guess. Ah, oh, this is extraordinary. There it is. How does stay right here? Oh, I'm not gonna send my general. In Greek classical hope lights are putting up incredible defense. I think very soon their general will fall. And our allies are so fucking dumb they cannot deal with this skirmisher army. This is so fucking pathetic. And so fucking annoying as well. Look at this, this fucking general is still alive after... This is unbelievable. I sent, I have sent so many units against him. And he's still alive there. Almost all of my army is retreating now. In fact, my army is broken. I wonder... How can I help? Because I have no troops left. And their turn is still alive with... Oh, only one. That's great. That means I'm gonna defeat him. Come on, put him down. You can do it. Except for the fact they gonna send an army to save him. Just no escape for him. Put him down. This is incredible how much these fucking Greek generals are resisting. What a stupid fucking game. Okay, where is our allies? Come on, what the fuck are you doing, you stupid motherfuckers? They cannot... They cannot deal with a poor army. Oh, they are retreating, or what? No, not yet. So it's very soon. They're gonna retreat. What they have here? Some classical hoplites. But their general is still alive, he's still fighting here. This is fucking bullshit as fuck. Finally, after so much time. Okay, let's chase them down, all of them. We shouldn't leave no one alive. Zaikendet has Alorios, has fallen. Here comes some um, study.
Yeah, that's okay. So they have only 60 troops inside. I think that they should be completely routed. And I think that we should be able to completely capture Athens. Let's see if they got attack with another army. No, they are still inside. But there is another fucking battle here. They have gone out with huge army. But our army is also extraordinary, so we cannot fight a battle because... Wait a minute. This is another army they have brought here, I think. From salt, maybe. Oh, there it is. This is an ambush. This is an ambush. Now what I want to do... That's what I want to do. Then, let them come. Come on, guys. Attack, if you dare. Now, their mistake is this. They are attacking the middle. Perhaps they think that they are able to... destroy our middle flank, but it's not gonna work. We have a very young general here. They have also a big general and a lot of cavalry here. These are some heavy skirmishers, but they count for nothing actually. gonna very soon encircle them. This should be a very easy battle. Come on, let's hunt them down. Some experience for our study. Let's hunt their general down. Do you think we'll simply die? But this is such a huge general, look at them. I think they're gonna be destroyed right away. Because I have to honestly say we're having this is one of the finest army that I think this is the finest army that we have on a battlefield right now. So there is their general. Or is that he's gonna die? Oh yes, that's great. That's okay then. If he's dead. Then it's okay. Wait, 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 wait. Let's sum them down to the last man. Okay, they still have those guys there. over. Yeah, that was a very, very good battle. Although we, had, we managed to take no experience as far as I can see, but that was really that was still a good battle. That wasn't the uh, army Sin Sinchitunum. It was another army they brought, a huge one, but has been almost reduced to ashes. So the Aperodes perhaps will soon think that we could attack and contribute also to the war against Macedonians. First and first of all, let's take Athens, shall we? Attack! 
some heavy cavalry. Still, we cannot send these guys back. And we have absolutely no offensive force left. They could kind of attack us and it would be too, too uh, dangerous. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake, you motherfucker. This is gonna cost, look at this, 28,000. You stupid motherfucker. Shit. Ah, oh, this is because we have destroyed the town, but... What is it? We're gonna... 20,000 denarii. It's gonna, just gonna bring some public order. You motherfucking piece of shit. We're not gonna repair nothing in Athens right now. Let's just destroy the fucking buildings first. Let's rebuild everything from so at least. Yeah, let's also repair some bulls just like that. Twenty-six thousand. That's good. Then let's see. We are having here. Possibility to recruit some manpower. And yeah, well, the thing is, shall we attack these guys? Or not? Just want them out. Let's attack them. Let's get out of them. Well, I'm not sure we're gonna manage to defeat them because our army here in the side seems to be so poor. General! Attack! Wait a minute, maybe we can. No, I don't think we can attack these guys as well. It's gonna be a waste of troops. Sir. We should have another general. We need to send, but we don't. And second of all, Orders. let's besiege Orders. this town. General. Attack! Besieging settlement, sir. Settlement under siege, sir. Orders. And the truth is, should be able. No, motherfucker! I didn't Attack. tell you to do that, you red motherfucker. You stupid motherfucking piece of shit, red motherfucker. Whatever, what's done is done, motherfucker. Yeah, I think we're gonna be able to just uh, assault them next time, take it out. I'm gonna take the risk anyway. Right, um, in the meantime, I gonna need more troops here because. No, wait a minute, I have a better idea. Let's recruit a general, because this guy is anyway too old and he's gonna die soon. Then, let's build some new things now that we have this advantage to build very, very cheap things to look at this. As well as this one. Because they are so cheap and we can expand this settlement even further more. This is great. So let's just do this. So next turn, we're just gonna fight a battle here against these barbarians. Then, perhaps the battle here. Well, I don't think so. Gonna recruit more troops from here. Gonna create new armies in Corinthus, in uh, Sparta. Simply because we have a lot of uh, manpower. So let's gonna try to retrain some of our troops and possibly attack the Macedonians even farther. We're gonna take Sigundum, and we should put up a new army here in uh, Italy. We're gonna need, of course, a new general. Actually, let's do it without the general, because we anyway have a lot of troops now. There you go. Athens is also ours. So we have a big part of Greece now. I think this is an extraordinary advantage. But we're gonna expand farther north and soon invade Asia Minor. Also have to keep an eye on Thasians, especially on Pontus. They're also having very heavy troops here. Very heavy hoplites and eastern mercenaries. 
Okay, now we're gonna have to. This town here, they're all, uh, having all the time. They're a negative public order. <coughs> anyway, everything seems to be okay here. Which is good, they're just gonna keep the mess that uh, Carthaginians busy, hopefully they will not besiege us. They are too dumb to do that, they can't even attack there. I have a lot of troops here. Sir. Gonna put up a new army here in Rome. Let's see what else do we have. Alright, I'm just gonna need more troops, let's do them right here. Yeah, let's retrain this as well. And now, let's see, let's build... There's already something being built. And be brought to. Oh, we cannot build anything here. The mono. Good, that's enough. So I'm gonna continue next time guys. Like I said, next time we're gonna try to settle down and to consolidate what we conquer here in like, Greece because almost the whole of Greece is ours. Almost just but just right there. Just about to take the whole of Greece. Then we're gonna take the Zin Zin and I think we're gonna try another offensive in the north in here. Though it's very difficult, but we'll try it. Then, I'm try to send these guys forward, put up a new army in Rome. Right. That will be all. I have to say, so far so good. This is the map, this is how the map looks like in 216 before Jesus Christ, before Christ. Now, what we have here is that we have taken Greece and this is absolutely great. Like I said, we should be able to expand even farther, including taking Pella and many other Macedonian towns here, Tracia and so on to help out our allies, uh, the Jets, and the Emperors that will perhaps betray us, we will see. We'll also try to invade Crete, maybe, and take this town here. We'll see about that. I'm not sure how the map looks like right now. I think there has been a lot of changes. I think that the Ptolemy have expanded a lot. They also have a lot of Macedonian or post-Alexander uh, units that they are building. Okay, good, so thank you very much for watching and until next time, goodbye.